Car Minister Armel Seo kidnapped for rebel chief. The militia group which abducted Central African Republic's sports minister has demanded the release of its detained commander, the minister's spokeswoman has said. Armel Seo was seized while returning from church on Sunday by men linked to anti-Balaka militia commander Rodrigue Nagibona, Tatiana Yanjiko said. The men had briefly abducted three people in the capital Bangui last week. Car has been gripped by religious and ethnic conflict since March 2013. Mr. Seo is the first government minister to be abducted since the conflict broke out. Pulled from vehicle. The anti-Balaka is a mainly Christian militia formed to oppose the Muslim-led Selika rebel group which overthrew President Francois Bozais in 2013. Selika handed power to an unbacked transitional government last year, but large parts of the country continue to be lawless. UN troops arrested Mr. Nagibona, known as General Angelo, earlier this month. UN peacekeepers in Bangui. UN peacekeepers earlier arrested one of the militia's leaders. He was wanted for alleged murder and rape in connection with attacks on minority Muslims in December 2013, as well as on charges over rebellion and looting. Ms. Yanjiko said contact had been made between Mr. Seo's family and the kidnappers, who were demanding Mr. Najibona's release in exchange for the minister's freedom. She did not give further details. Mr. Seo was on his way home from church when his car was accosted in Bangui's Galabadja neighborhood by fighters in an unmarked taxi, his wife, Nikes Danielle Seo, told Associated Press News Agency. They instructed us to stop. They pulled him from his vehicle to put him in their car to head to Boyrabi, their stronghold, said MRSAO, who was with her husband when he was abducted. An armed anti-Balaka militiaman, C, gestures as he walks by houses allegedly destroyed by former Selika militiamen in Buka, some north of Bangui, on April 25, 2014. The anti-Balaka have been involved in fierce fighting with Selika rebels. French aid worker Claudia Priest in Paris on January 25, 2015. Freed French aid worker Claudia Priest arrived in Paris on Sunday. Last week, a Kurdish UN employee, a French aid worker and her local colleague briefly were abducted. The aid worker, Claudia Priest, 67, returned to France on Sunday. Her abduction was said to be linked to Mr. Najibona's arrest and the circumstances around her release and that of the other two people are unclear. The conflict in Kar has killed thousands and displaced about one million. The UN plans to bolster its troop presence in the country to 10,000 by April. It currently has about 8,700 troops there.